Hey everyone, it's Thackard, and welcome back to more of Survival Fountain of Youth. We are doing our pacifist playthrough. Last time we kind of got to the point where we are just about ready to go exploring the new region. Um, over on my stream, I just uh, I've been playing the a hardcore version where I'm doing one life on very hard, and I just went over to the uh, the region in that playthrough. So knowing how things went over uh, that time, kind of use that to help give me a wee bit of an advantage. Now it shouldn't be too bad. What we'll do is we'll get our armor set up first, get all the things that we'll need for that, and then we will build all that over there. Hopefully we will be able to do everything my, my one concern is that the Tigus on the next region are very aggressive. So I don't know how good it's going to go. We shall see. We shall see. All right. Um... We're going for. Okay. But we'll want to make have enough stuff so we can make a saltwater distiller, have enough for our water taps or uh, juice taps. And those all look good. We're just waiting on the one dried hide. Is that it? Right. Oh, we already had one. Maybe it's in the box. Nope, it's a process side. Okay, so how much longer in this one do we have? Nine hours. All right. In that case, these mushrooms are done. Let's start doing more. We have more dates. No, oh, I don't need seven. Eh, I'll get some more somewhere else. Just need the six. All right. Put in the dates. Wonderful. All right. You are ready. We don't have a container for the water. Dried mushrooms can go in here. Go drink all that. We'll bring some water. Get that lit up. Start making some salt because we'll want to salt some fish. We'll want to salt some. Oh, we won't have fish though, will we? Because we're not going to kill anything. We might be able to get some meats from things that we find. Every once in a while, you will find a dead critter. You know, since we don't need the salts, the distiller is much less necessary, or at least over here. One of the things I did forget when I went to the other location is to bring components for a level three, tier three uh, cooking station. So we'll want to do that, which means we're going to have to have another pot. Need some more fuel. We need any fuel. Grab some of those. Let's grab that. All right, light it up. Wonderful. Oh, 
We do have four, uh, four pieces of animal fat and five raw meat. I'm thinking I'm going to... Hmm. I might salt, salt the raw meat. Just let it stay for as long as possible. All right. So let's come over here. We will make some strips. And then we will make a pot. We will fire the pot. That's now going. So salt those. I'm thinking we're going to probably make oil out of all of these. Could make one thing of soup. Alright. So we're going to need... Let's gather the resources. We're going to need a pot, which we're making. Then three long sticks, five small sticks, and three stones. One, two, three, five, and then three long sticks. One, two, and three. All right. It's also, you know what? We're going to be able to grab some half logs over there. 13 minutes for that. And what, another seven hours? Three hours, nice. Hmm. We have two eggs. I think I'm going to run into the jungle really quick. Also want to bring a hammer as well over there. We're going to run into the jungle right fast here, and we are going to... Well, this is probably done. Let's not waste... I'm going to grab some breadfruit. And we're going to make some... healing bread uh, cakes. Just in case we were to get banged up a little bit, we'll have some additional healing. Because we can't get any of the healing potions or medicinals. Because the that would require us to kill the fish. Because we would need we would need the Dorado fins. And uh not gonna do it. So yeah. Makes life a little more Difficult. Alright, snake there. Alright, so it's not up yet. Shoo. All right, I think we've cleared out all the breadfruit. Unfortunate, but you know what? That's okay. We'll just cook up the uh, eggs. Pick up the eggs, make some water or make some soup. When we get to the next island, we'll be able to grab some coffee. It'll keep us nice and awake. We won't ever have to sleep again. I think they should add a like a like a positive buff to be like being well rested, to where if you don't sleep for a while. Even if you're just mainlining coffee, you're going to have, like, negative effects on you somehow over time. Where, you know, coffee helps, but you can't just 
forego sleep for the rest of the game. It seems a little off. I'm going to wait for this finish up. So we do have one lamp oil ready. Builder kit's ready. We have a axe to bring with us. Wonderful. We're going to need a hammer. You know what? Um, let's do a little cooking right now. I never do this. Let's... I'm going to grab two of those, do those up, grab these two, do those up, I'm overweight, uh, get you up, cook these two guys, now we're going to cook the juice we'll transfer this juice into here all right now we can make some soup excellent um I think that's gonna be it there's nothing else we need to make is there we only have Oh, the eggs. Uh, as long as we're here, let's also make up some more mapping charcoal. Gonna make sea salt here as well. Don't think it's needed. All right, stash that stuff. Wonderful. All right, this one is now dried. We can start the next one up. There we go. Curious here, can we upgrade our storage? We didn't get any any animal tendon, but we will get thread off the off the boat uh, off the Santa Maria, so that will work. How long until those are done? Another ten hours. All right. So we will be able to uh, make a better bag question is do we want to up oh, we're sleepy <sighs> wasn't even lock, uh, looking to see how much uh, time that was going to be just hit the button some water in us these are both done now wonderful let's grab some salt did we really only get one salt that's okay And so this one's ready. Not going to use it right now, so we'll stash it. You can start to fill up our... Uh, let's see here. We'll take this and these... We should take some medicine.
I'm gonna use a snake potion in case we get overheated. I think this will be fine though. Oh, we actually need two more sticks as well. Let's sit these guys at the bottom. We have the food up top. Alright, box. Take all of that. We're also going to disassemble the box. Which will give us those sticks we needed. Huh. Alright, so apparently I only had enough for one of our uh, juice collectors. I probably don't have enough bamboo if I was to hazard a guess. I could go on a bamboo run, but I think I'll be fine with just one. We'll take that. I think we're... We'll disassemble this. We'll have some big branches that we find along the way. But I want to take a couple split logs so we can make a dehydrator over there. Although, the only thing that we'd be, we would be dehydrating would be dates. Oh, also coffee. So yes, we are going to need it for the coffee. Yes, 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 yes. We are going to need it for the coffee. Cannot forget the coffee. Failed. 80% failed. There we go. It's coming along. There we go. We have a salt already. It's to salt in this next piece of meat. I'm going to make all of these into uh, oil. We might as well bring like two of them along with us. Bring along another coconut. I'm going to just prepare some of these coconuts for food right now. Munch on them. We'll need... I uh, know, because we're not going to grab another... We're not going to go for another piece of bamboo. Sorry, I hit my microphone. Rip beers. <clears throat> it's going well. have any more sea salt yet uh wide leaves are pretty prevalent Let's grab some and eh, we'll have narrow leaves as well actually gonna bring along some more sticks for boxes and such a couple more stones for whatever as well as the rope We do have sticks, long sticks over there, but we'll grab these. You know what? Uh, we're going to upgrade this boat so we can have the larger box as well. And I believe this one does not require us to murder eat anything else. Yeah. Wonderful. We got the big box. We cannot go again, can we? Because it takes two dried. So we're not going to get the good bed, the really nice bed. 
That's fine. We will build our own when we get there. We're going to need one of these. What is that guy? And a rope. All right. We're going to replace our axe right now because it's getting ready to break. Let's also make up a hammer for over there. Are there any other tools we might need? In theory, no. Disassemble that. We'll get the handle back. We will make a new one. Okay, back in business. So we're going to need at least one of these, at least a single slot one, maybe a double slot. That would be three boards. We just did one slot. It would just be two boards. All right, so we're going to have to cut down a single tree anyways. We'll, get, we'll have to get some long sticks from over there. Let's go murder a tree. Yeah, hang on a second. Um, let's murder a Chinese tree. Do I not have any Chinese palms left? Doesn't look like it. Small palms. Small palm, small palm. It looks like I only have small palms left. Okay. Chinese palms are nice because on the easier difficulties, they will give you uh, more logs. They will give you two logs instead of just a single log. Which makes, makes them a lot nicer to use. You don't have to clear as much stuff. Alright. What's our percentage chance that we'll hurt ourselves? 17, I'll try. Go. Alright, the other thing we're going to have to make is our tent. This will protect us against sun and rain. Um, it gives us 10 sleep per hour. Could make ourselves a little hovel instead. Nah, I think I think that requires like leather probably for the bed. I th I think the best one we're going to be able to do this is four hides so we're not going to be able to do that so yeah the best one we're going to be able to do for our survival is the hut made of leaves i mean this would be really nice but we would need four hides for it and that just goes against what we're saying uh, doing so we're not going to get that wonderful 16 energy per sleep we're only going to get the 10. We'll make do. All right, so let's grab two more big branches, some wide leaves, some narrow leaves, some liana. We'll have to make that one primarily on location because we don't have any more. I doubt that will help. Oh, it did help. Wonderful. Use the massive stone. Easy peasy now. Okay, so we have three split logs. 
We don't have enough for, like I said, the... I think we probably want to make a canopy over there as well as the bed of leaves. So the first night or so we will sleep on the raft. I think though, we are pretty much ready to go. Those are not done yet. Just going to eat those. Eat that. And then we will heal up. There we go. We are healed up to full. These guys have three hours left on them. I want to start up the next piece of meat. So do we take the Navy coat with us? The armor might be nice. We're not going to need the rain protection. We're not going to need the cold protection. We could use the wind protection on the, uh, on the windy island. I think we'll bring it with us. I don't think we'll use it. Though, right away. All right. I don't think we need to make the coconut mortar. There's can't make this. We will make this. Doesn't require the mortar though, does it? Maybe it does. It's easy enough to make, so it won't be that much of a pain. All right. Fill up our juice box. I'm not going to actually take it with us. I'm going to leave it over here. So when we, when or if we return, we will have some stuff to drink and eat. all these green coconuts we have it's just stacked up man good to go are these about done one hour on this guy yeah, unless we go back in to grab some like long branches we're pretty much ready to go we could break this down for the long branches let's do that here we go all evidence of that ghastly death that we caused has now been removed. The only place where you would even know that it happened is that horrific sail. Uh, all right. Gonna wait for that one piece of meat to be finished so we can get the next one started and uh i think that will be it i think we are completely ready to go to do this um going to bring the dried hide with us because we might be able to make the hide backpack. Because we're going to get thread off the boat. All right. 
I guess we can bring some additional firewood with us. A little more lamp oil. Another piece of... Uh, we're going to have pyrite over there. Ours is still good. Eh, it's starting to wear down. We'll, we'll bring it with just in case. All right. You want to read any books? Book of Hunting? Nope. Juice box? Nope. Still have two living waters. Finish that and add the next one. Wonderful. Good for 183 days, so we won't even have to mess with anything else. All right. I guess we could take the bed with us, but I think we'll just make a new one over there. Okay. So I think we are officially ready to go. Toss everything in here. Yep. We are officially ready to take off. Uh, we will do a lap around the islands that are here. We will try and get down to the Santiago to grab the uh, iron, the the, well, the, uh, the swimming book, as well as the two iron toolkits. Uh, hopefully the shark will leave us alone. But we will do all of that next time. So next time, guys, we go sailing. Our boat is ready to go. Our supplies are stocked up. When we get to the new uh, island, we can build up our camp pretty darn quick. Just we'll have to gather a couple of items and we'll be good to go. Um, so yeah, next time we will go and search the local islands and we will take a dive on the Santiago. And then we might even head on over to the next region as well next time. And then probably the following episode is going to be all about getting our camp set up and getting our seaweed clothing uh, armor all ready to go. So, catch you guys next time. Bye-bye. Start sailing. Yep, we're ready.